Okay, we are back. We're ready to go into this dungeon thingy for the queen, rights of the queen. Enter, enter, ten. So, will I have a group member now? So, ready to go in. Let's see, ready? Following the queen. You are no queen, Tyrell. You are a spoiled child. Give up, charade, the failed queen. You are it feels good to draw my sword again. Moonstone. I don't know, I take these bottles and then nothing happens. Or I don't find them in my inventory. Oh, come on, let's help the queen. Toast. The things I endure for my people. Kill them all. Let's go. Let's go, Queenie. The ancestors have forsaken you, my best. Want to stay down here any longer than we have to. Destroy that crystal over there. I'll take out the crystal by the door. What is she talking about? Take out that other crystal. I'll work on this one. All right. I see it. I see it. Took her out with my shield. <laughs> Is there anything good in here? Time to destroy this crystal and move on. Where are you, my queen? Oh, wait, there's gonna be a lore book, maybe? Okay, no lore book there. supposed to be one in here or not. Let's take a peek. Hmm. I don't, know, I don't want to miss something. Cults of Northern High Rock. Qu 
Mama A quiche. Ha <laughs> ha, yummy. It's the recipe. Ah, uh, no lore books. Bummer. Okay. Nothing in here. Oh, we go through here. Cool. Check this out. All right, my queen. I got your back. The veiled queen will lead us. Feels the ancestor you ancestors you guiding her. Let's go, let's go. Come on, Queen. Let's pick up the pace. Oh. Why struggle, I read. Two of them. I'm glad you're down here, my friend. Well, yeah, because you're not doing anything. Beyond this door lies the ancestral chamber at the very heart of Tenzelwell. If I complete the ritual and receive the ancestor's blessing, the people will finally accept me as King Tamlin's heir. Orion. Okay, so this is an Orion. I think I want to put my staff back on. As much fun as that other item is, that dagger. Still tend to like my staff better. Foolish girl. I serve the veil. She is our true leader. Oh, what the heck? True. Do not consort with savages and beasts. Pretty soon. Yeah. All right. Let's see what that guy's saying. That's pretty difficult. So that's why he wanted to join. Except now he's not in the. He's had to go do something, so he's AFK. Okay. He's back, I guess, but... Okay, but I just died. <laughs> hurry up, hurry up.
think we definitely need two people. He's level eight, and um, I'm nine, almost ten. But it's difficult because he has his other helpers come along. And for some reason. Okay, my sentry soup is there, but what happened to my. Huh. I thought I had more of that other stuff that I was munching on. Alright, I better put these up here. That's actually what I tried to find after I realized I didn't have any more of that other pie. Whoa, what's up, monkey? You're really tripping out. Oh, here we go. I think he's approaching. There we go. Cool. I serve the Veiled Queen. She is our true That's all he drops. Norian got what he deserved. <laughs> Time this ritual was ended. May the ancestors bless yeah! us with their wisdom and protection. <laughs> the ancestors honor your Woo! prayers. Yes! <laughs> May funny. the light of the eight bless you and guide you. Let your reign be long and peaceful. It's finished. Let's get out of this dark place. Follow me. That was cool. That was the first experience joining a group, even though it was one, not only one person. It was still cool. She said she died a bunch of times, so I got lucky that she wanted to join. So I didn't know what was ahead of me. You risked everything to help me. I won't forget it. Oh, shucks. Any time, my queen. You're too modest. Thank you, my <gasps> brave and noble friend. Uh oh, look at Until this. we meet again, wherever the road may take us. Look at, oh, and I get a skill point there, too. Eagle, banner, longbow. Oh, I'm going to have to play now. I'm going to start longbowing people. Longbowing? Is that a word? All right, complete quest. Okay, careful on the roads, my friend. You're a valuable resource to the Dominion. And me, of course. Completed. Defeated a traitor and saved the queen. Gained skill point. Do you have a moment for questions, Your Majesty? Oh, another achievement unlocked. Vale's first fall. Oh, yeah. It is a good day. Of course, my friend. Our little adventure here has brought up a few questions of my own. Are you worried about any of the other courtiers? Worried about them turning like Norian? Hmm. I don't believe so. Norian was old guard and never very fond of me. Most of the others awaiting us on the road honestly want change. How do we deal with the Veiled Heritants? Outright traitors like Norian we end, no question. The problem is that traitors like Norian are only fanning the flame. If I can't win over my people, the Heritants will be dealing with me instead of the other way round. What will we do now? 
We have dozens of stops along the road, speaking at farms and holdfasts. My next big event is in Skywatch, I believe. They're throwing a festival, and I'm to make a public appearance with my sister-in-law, Estri. Always thrilling. <laughs> you and she aren't uh, very close, then. There's no love lost there, no. My brother took the news of my return fairly well, all things considered. I'm not sure his wife has it in her to be as forgiving. She wanted to be queen. That's funny. All right. Talk to you later. Oh, who's this guy? Battle Reeve or Selmo? Oh, he's going to give us another quest. Yes, he is. He's a high elf. One day, over a drink, you must tell me what happened down there. For now, the Queen's safety is my primary concern. What now, Battle Reeve? Razum Dar has been investigating threads in the Veiled Heritance plot. We think he's caught a break in Matisson, and he could use some help. Head up there and lend him a hand, will you? Yes, sir. Battle Reeve, okay, so... Now to see... Now to see... Which quest is closest, so... Next quest I have that pops up immediately is Return to Hendel, which I need to ask. That's an, something I still need to do for a while. Okay, wait. Hit T. We'll go through the quest here. So I have Plague of Fire. Return to Hendel. Go to Methesen, which is some, another quest from before. Meet the Resumdar near Methesen. Find Merrick. Enter the Banished Cells, which I really want to do. Okay, let's look at the map. Wow, what's on here? Seaside Scarp Camp. That skull and skull with the swords, doesn't that make me, uh, that makes, uh, makes me curious. I want to go there. Okay, oh wait, I gotta put my skill points too. So here's another one. Oh, there's more than, oh, there's several, okay. I want to go in there too, find some good, uh, loot. Okay, so we have here, meet with Razum Dar. Oh, my old friend Razum, I forgot about him. He's the Khajiit with the Mohawk. And this is go to Methesen, so I would need to go here first, I think. And this is return to Hendel, which I need to do. Okay, I want to go over here. Set destination with F. Okay, I can do that, huh? Oh, cool. Alright, so I set my destination. So now that should show on the compass. Yep, there it is, the little triangle. Or the diamond shape, blue, blue diamond shape icon. I wonder what that is. Tanzel will. Tanzel will? What's this thing? Have I been there? You defeated a traitor and saved the queen. Okay. Who's screaming, man? I want to go stop him from screaming. This guy. Alright. So, I need to put uh, my skill point on, so I'm going to go over here because I think it's a safe spot. And let's see. If I can sit down, take a break. We'll go check. Oh, he stands up anyway. Oh, yeah, I got this bow, too. I'm stoked. Okay, let me look at weapons. This one does 22 damage. Deals 6 flame damage. Increase weapon and spell critical values by 4%. Queen Irene herself has tuned and tightened the bowstring on this weapon, ensuring every arrow flies straight and true. Oh, that's a sweet bow. Okay, so compared to this bow... Oh, much better. Oh, okay, so now I'm going to sell this bow. I never got into the bow thing. I think I fired this off a couple times way back when I first got it. But I'm going to start trying to bow, I think. I need to try it. I think so. But to me, the bow, I don't know. What happens when they come up close? It just seems weird. be better when you're 15. You can have this as a secondary. 
That would be sweet. Then you can just switch quickly between weapons. Oh, yeah. Let me see if I can uh, enchant it. No, it won't let me enchant this one. I wonder why. Maybe I have to put it on first? Let's see. Let's see. No, still won't. Alright, so let's go back to the important stuff now. Is attribute points zero. Oh, what's this? That active effects. Molten weapons. Oh, somebody just buffed me with something. I didn't even see that happen. Skill points. Oh, I have two? Sweet. And then I have one more skill shard. We'll get me another one. Okay, so I have two skill points, huh? About to get another one when I when I turn ten. Um piercing javelin, puncturing strikes. Radial sweep. I need to open that up, don't I? Deal 69 magic damage to all nearby enemies. Uh, do I want to open this up, or do I want to up upgrade this more? Oh, my goodness. The decisions. Look at this. There's so many things. Sunfire. Oh, my goodness. This is my healing one. I think I need to bring the healing one. This is this one heals nearby wounded ally for 109. Heals nearby allies for 88. Sel heals self for an additional 30. Um, sheesh, okay. I think I'm going to put one here. Okay, so it branches off now. Morph ability. Select an ability that you wish to morph healing. Ritual 4 into. Okay, casting 1.7 seconds, target area, 10 meter radius, cost 105 magicka. Heals nearby allies for 88, heals self for an additional 30%. New effect has reduced cast time. And this one, lingering ritual, cast time 2 seconds, so it's a bit longer. 10 meters, 105. Same cost in Magicka. Heals nearby allies for 88. Same. Heals self for an additional 30%. After 8 seconds, affected targets are healed for an additional 20. New effect, additional healing after 8 seconds. Well, this one does more, so why would you even go with that? Oh, it has reduced cast time. Oh, no way, go with this. Coolio, okay. So I have one point left. Rich, rite of Passage. Heals allies, nearby allies, for 34 every 5.5 5 seconds. For 4 seconds. You cannot move while channeling this ability. Oh, I don't know. Armor? Increase health regeneration by 2%. I think I... Oh, I can't. Shoot. I have to do this maybe first. I already did it once. I have one added to... So basically that increases health regeneration by 2% per piece of heavy armor equipped. Current bonus 10%. Next upgrade's at level 18. So I got a ways to go. Increase armor by 1% and base spell resist by 1% for each piece of heavy armor. Equipped. Current bonus is 5% armor. 14 spell resist. I have 1 out of 3. What's on the light armor? Oh, I need to open up one of these. Reduces the magicka cost of spells by 1%. Per piece of light armor. Increases magicka regeneration by 2%. Per piece of light armor. Wait, don't I have... Am I not wearing light armor? Medium. Heavy. Medium. Heavy. 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 I don't have any light armor. Oh boy, I need to get two pieces of light armor. 
All right. Well, I'm going to have to put one of these on. This is light armor here. So is this, but I don't want the full chest piece on. Um, okay, I'll put the boots. I'd rather put something like the belt and maybe the gauntlets, but um, I'll equip this for now. At least I'll get, um, at least I'll get a bonus out of this. Let's see. Yeah. I want to use this one. Increase Magicka Regeneration. Okay. I need to get one more light armor piece, I think. And my mediums I need to replace to heavy armor. Just I'm just wearing whatever's dropping, though, really, except for the belt I bought that. Let's try this bow real quick. Fighter's Guild increased to two. Wow, this bow is actually really good. Wow, I've, I'm surprised. That was quite painless. I want to kill more people with it. to five. Oh, look what I... Oh, my goodness. That's a good sword. That's a very good sword. Six flame damage, increased weapon and spell critical values by four percent. Plus another ectoplasm. have been a dot on that some damage over time effect or something this bow is actually pretty bad to the bone look at that it sets them on fire what the heck is up with that that is just no that is too cool why did you do that let's see Oh yeah! Which one am I using? Maple bow of shot? No. Deal six flame damage. Oh yeah, that is so killer. Turn to handle. Wow, okay. I've been getting a lot accomplished this past couple hours. Let's head on out this way. Can I go this way? really well so basically just like your melee weapon if you have a sword or an axe or whatever you click on the left button right but if you just do a quick click he does a quick shot it doesn't hit as hard 
if you hold the left bound, let him draw, pull all the way back, and then fire, that does more damage. But when I'm doing the, the running around stuff, then I'm just doing quick shots. Like that. See? And look at his damage. It's not as much, but if I draw... Oh, he healed himself. Yeah, he's toast. That's how it works. Oh, look at this. Another one. Maple Lightning Staff. Oh, nice. That's a good one. Not as good as mine. Has everything mine does except for the increased weapon and spell critical values. But it'll sell for 26 gold, and that is very good. Very good. I'm starting to see better equipment, so I can make more gold by selling it. Wow. I don't need your help. I'm Ziggy. Oh, I got you right in the doodads. <laughs> I don't know. I'm loving this bow. I think with the last time I was doing the bow, it wasn't as cool because my staff was more fun. You know, the visual effects are better. But now with this bow, it's, it's setting on fire. So I think that's why I'm liking it because the other bow didn't do that. Take a take a swig. Wow, leveled up even. Oh, there's another skill point. All right, that's cool. Another achievement, level 10, unlocked. I can block. Pop you right in the head. Two gold for that I can sell for. Wow, my bags, how are my bags looking? Ooh, ten more slots. Alright, I think I need to just um, collect a bunch, of, fill my bags, go sell it, make that in gold, and then go uh, move on. Oh, feed my horse, get another inventory slot. stuff. They don't drop stuff. Alright, who's not dropping? Why aren't you dropping? Take that butterfly. Is that a sky shard over there? What is that? Can't be. My goodness, if it is, I'm going to freak out. No, it's, it's just a light that looks like a sky shard light. Oh, ethereal well? 
What does this do? Holy smokes, what was that? What did I just get? What just... What? Did I get another skill point? I got one for just leveling up, but do I have two now? Attribute points. I have an attribute point, but that was from leveling up. I wonder what that well did. Nothing. Okay, so skill points. Light armor. Choose the magicka cost of spells by 1%. What about my racial? Oh, yes, this is open now. Gift to Magnus increases ma max magicka by 4%. Yes, I want that for sure. Oh, and then I have a... What do I have? Attribute points. Do I have a title yet? Nope, no title. I'm still nobody. Magicka or health? Or stamina? Magicka is so important, I think, right now. Need one more sky shard. Look at my bow. That's so cool. getting on my nerves. Who does he think he is messing with me? It's just amazing. I don't think I've ever liked a bow so much as I have this one. This is amazing. I am practically speechless. I think now I need to move on. Well, there's another town here, so maybe I can just go up there and sell stuff, but I thought I had another quest down here. Alright, well, we're going to move here. Okay, but I'm going to pause the video for a bit. Let uh, Ziggy and Monkey catch their breath. Um, so you know what to do if you haven't subscribed. May the ancients guide you subscribe. And also hit the like button and share if you liked it. So we'll catch you next time. Have a good one. We'll be back shortly. Okay, this is real quick. Um, I just got mail and I opened it up and it's because I turned level 10. So I quickly wanted to add this here. Um, Cyrodiil awaits. Ziggy, your achievements in Tamriel have been noted. We need warriors of your caliber on the battlefields of Cyrodiil. Be warned, however, veterans of the Alliance Wars are far more dangerous foes than you have ever faced before. Join us! So I got this because I turned level 10, which means now I qualify for the PvP. And PvP, if you looked at um, my prior videos during an alpha, during the alpha, I um, cranked all weekend just to get to level 10 and get some PvP action in. So I think I got about, uh, I don't know, an hour and a half of PvP in before the weekend ended for the alpha weekend. 
So, okay, well, we are out for now. We'll catch you in the next one. Thanks a lot.